this is where you have to take care because any, any poor pass leaves us very open. Okay? If he has a man 10 yards the other side, what would you do? Yes. But if they were marked, what could you do with him? You could. Or get it back. So you could use him. So. Yes, yeah, and again. And then play. Because what will, what will, what will the opposition do? Yeah, he will probably come with him and then you can play the other side. Yeah? Good. I kind of work with the ball in three stages. So build up one is in the defensive third, build up two in the middle third and break through in the final third. Um, so today was build up one. So the goalkeeper becomes your spare man. Um, you need the other players to have the trust in him with his feet. So, you know, whenever he's got it, if he can draw the player towards him, then there's going to be a spare player somewhere. And then it's about finding that spare player. So you can use other players as a bounce or the goalkeeper can actually play it there himself. Or he plays over the pressure and, uh, you know, plays into a spare man there as well. As two centre-backs and a defensive midfielder, we have a 4v2. We have a, a diamond shape. So we're always trying to create a triangle in that. So we have a triangle here, triangle there, and you'll see the triangles throughout the pitch. So you always have an option, either side. Good. Play! Good. Less touches. Go and score. Go and score. Good. Bagus. Yeah. 